Okay guys, on that last part of the video, you might have saw that uh, I thought the radio wasn't responding when I kind of came back onto the driveway. You can see that the wheels were cranked one way. Let's see if I can get a close up here of it. You can see that it pretty much back away a little bit. Trip the servo right out. So it looks like we're going to have to get a metal gear servo. So that's got some metal gears, maybe a titanium one. So that doesn't happen. You get into a racing situation that's really going to wax on that servo. Other than that, it's got great turning radius for the steering setup on it. Really happy with it. You guys be able to see a little bit closer. Do a little overview of it here. Let me clip the body off real quick. You gotta check out the Clod Pounder. What we gonna name this truck? Got a ground pounder chassis. Quad buster axles. CP lower links. Tracks of shocks. Real nice truck. Got great suspension on it. Nice and soft, not stiff. As you can see in the video before, it soaks them up real well. See the fans are running right now. Got dual cooling fans on top of the ESCs. I buttoned a couple of the connections up so it keep away from the fans. I think I might be getting a little bit of interference too because this is strapped to the metal chassis. Or maybe the servo wire strapped to that. So make a little couple adjustments on it might end up swapping radios but for now I'm gonna leave her like she is replace the steering servo and have fun with it raffle ride can't complain when it's free just put a battery in it some double A's in the old transmitter oh and we got the off for the demon mosquitoes out here and our previous filmer from before was Katie she's out in the pool Not swimming. Say hi, Katie.